How's it going everybody? Today I'm teaching you how to build this automatic boat dock and boat house. As you can see, it is a pretty small and simple house. But what is cool about it is that the dock is automatic, meaning your boat will end up in a chest inside of your house for your next use. Now let me show you how it works. So let's say you've been out boating for a while, and you come over to your house, you can run right into this cactus, and the hoppers right here will bring your boat into the chest, which is located inside of the house right here. So now if you open up the door, your boats will be right down here in this chest right here. And then you can put whatever you want inside of this house. I put a double chest as well as a crafting table. Then you can walk out of the house and go to wherever you need to go. Now let me show you what you would do if you were coming from the back of the house. So you'd walk right into the house right here, go into this chest, grab your boat, and you could walk right outside here, and you can place your boat, and then you can take it to wherever you need to go. I'm going to be showing you how to build the automatic boat dock as well as the house. To build this, you're going to need one cactus, one sand, five hoppers, three chests, three pieces of glass, four torches, a bucket of water, two doors, 30 blocks of choice, 28 wood of choice, a crafting table, and a bunch of boats. To start it off, we're going to be deleting a 3x5 platform into the ground, so just delete three just like this and bring it back four additional rows. Now we're going to delete out one more block for our sand, so right here, then your piece of cactus. Then we're going to go where the house is going to go and delete a few more blocks. So I'm going to delete right in the center and go down two, then put my chest. And then I'm going to figure out a path for the hoppers. So if you like to come in from the left side, I recommend going hoppers going this way, which is what I did for this design. But if you like to boat a lot and you come from the right side, then you can build your hoppers going to the right. Just delete out the five slots. Then place your hoppers going into the chest and then going into the hopper behind it. With this design, I have to come in from the left side or if I come in from the right, there's a less chance of it working. So now you can grab your piece of glass and put it right there, as well as grabbing your water and putting the water down everywhere to make every spot an infinite water source. So it should look something just like this. Now we're going to delete out two blocks right here as well as one block directly behind it. Then we are going to begin construction on the house. So what you're going to need is your block of choice, your wood of choice, torches, a chest, your crafting table, and your doors. Now you're going to grab your wood of choice and place it directly diagonal, four blocks up on both sides of the water source. And then a three block gap, one, two, three. On the fourth block, place another four blocks of your wood, as well as the same for the other side. Now we can put our doors in. So I like to face this way, just like that. Oops, I like to face the other way, I'm sorry. So the door is like this, so that way you can actually hop onto this block so you can open the door to get into the house easier from when you are boating. Same with the other side. Go inside the house and place the door. Now we're going to grab our blocks of choice and just place them around the house. I'm using stone brick because I think it looks the best, but it's totally up to you. Just place it in the same pattern I am doing. And then you can put your glass directly in the middle. The sides with the door, just place your blocks of choice all the way around. And the same for the last side with the window right there. Now what we're going to do is grab our wood of choice again and place it just like this going around. Then you can grab your block of choice and cover up the roof just like this. Before it gets too dark, you're probably going to want to put some torches in. I like to put two right here, and the same with the other door. If you like going out this way, 
then I recommend putting the door the same way mine is. But if you like going out on the right side, I'd recommend placing the door just like this. It's totally up to you. I prefer going in on the left side, so I'm going to keep the door like this. So now you can put your double chest here, or whatever side you don't want to enter. As well as your crafting table. And you can put your boats in here. And now let's give it a try. So what we're going to do is I'm actually going to go in the back of the house. And pretend like I was going boating. So you'd walk in the house, close the door behind you, grab your boat. Then walk out the door and make sure to place your boat a little far away from the cactus or else it will end up something like that. Then you can go on to wherever you need to go. And coming back, just make sure you come in on the side where the hoppers are. So your boat will end up going through the hoppers and into that chest right there. Before you click away, there's one more thing you're going to want to do. As you can see, my build on the right, the cactus has grown to two blocks tall and if you don't like this look right here you can either put a few blocks out like one more yeah that won't work so you can either go like that or what you could do is put a block directly above it like a half slab or something that looks a little nicer so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to grab a half slab and I'm going to place it right here. I think that looks the best. It's totally up to you. If you want it to keep growing, go for it. But this way if you add a half slab you can still run into it and it should still work. That is going to be it for the video guys. Be sure to give it a like and subscribe. Otherwise you can follow me on my Instagram at mgsrgaming and I will see you in the next one. Click in the top left to watch a video that YouTube recommends for you and click on the right to subscribe because there are new videos coming out every other day.